Dr. Elaine Perry tells me the health district is not seeing a great increase in illnesses compared to 2022, which is certainly reassuring. In fact, flu cases are way down, but she says the threat is definitely still out there. So we are seeing a lot of both upper respiratory viruses. So the things that we talk about, COVID-19, uh, influenza, RSV, or the respiratory syncytial virus. Dr. Perry, the director of the Richmond Henrico Health District, says last year we did experience a very difficult flu season and it was earlier than expected. Now she says flu cases are increasing and that is among flu cases that are actually being reported. She says we may be seeing the peak and rise of flu cases later than last year too, but the flu, RSV and COVID are not the only threats out there right now. We've also started to see more um, what we would call gastrointestinal illness. So nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, um, all those are on the rise as well. And again, that's not unexpected this time of year. We, we do see that. Some of this disease is caused by the norovirus. Dr. Perry says it is not too late to get your COVID and your flu shots. And most importantly, keep washing your hands, coughing and sneezing in your sleeve staying home when you're sick. In the studio, I'm Brendan King, CBS 6 News.